Oh, it's not recording. All right. So real quick, let's edit the volume a little bit because it does seem a little loud even for me right now. Sound effects. Go down to there. Music. Down to there. Cinematics. We'll go down to there. All right. I actually do have my own Fallout Equestria uh, story called Icicle, or like Project Icicle, I forget what exactly it's called. Um, it's on Fim Fiction if you want to read that. I'm not going to read it, there's a lot of flaws story-wise in it, and uh, even though I enjoy the story because I wrote it, um, it does not match canon very well. So. Yeah, anyway, let me just check the rest of these settings. Uh, language is English, stopwatch, I don't know what that is. Subtitles, yes. Video, that all looks very good. Perfect. Controls. Okay. All right, I was thinking I might have to use a, uh, a controller for this, but it looks fine. Hey, Shadow, welcome to the stream. Just in time for the beginning of it. All right, let me just check one thing here real quick. Okay, what's the skin selector? Currently equipped. So we got a different variety of skins that we can get for these uh, vulture looking icons, I'd say. Just a moment here. Okay, that's fine. Let's start the journey and find out how fun this game is. <clears throat> Once upon a time, in the great Arkansil Kingdom, the world lived in peace and coexistence between the humans, the animals, the birds, even the cute little bunny rabbits. It was an age of prosperity without any fear of war, famine, catastrophe. It was so very boring. So boring, in fact, that even the devil himself was bored brainless. The devil dreamed of bloodshed, pestilence, suffering on a cosmic scale. So, he devised a plan to make things in Arkansas a little more entertaining. The devil unleashed the curse of the Eternal Night. A powerful spell that conjured mindless, soulless, heartless monsters across the world. The monsters laid waste to every city, every home, every leaky outhouse, and backwater town in the kingdom. It was beautiful, but for some reason, the humans quite enjoyed their safe, boring little lives. They couldn't handle a few pesky monsters coming in and tearing them all limb from limb. So, they called mighty wizard a sorcerer with the skill and intellect to break the curse and usurp the devil's power the wizard departed his luxurious tower in his study to find the power he needed to break the curse of the eternal night very well the devil said two can play that game and who knows this might be the fun i've been looking for so in response to the wizard's quest he called upon a champion of his own. Stingy Jack, <laughs> history's greatest trickster and con artist, banished to wander the world as a wayward spirit. The devil crammed Jack's soul into the skin of a pumpkin and made him a deal. The devil would forgive Jack's past misdeeds and grant him passage to the afterlife. And in return, he gave Jack one simple mission. Find Destroy him. Oh my god. This game's better than I thought. We're the bad guy. Woo! <laughs> you gotta love games where you're the bad guy. Hello everyone, welcome to Jack. Pumpkin Jack. <laughs> Alright. Let's learn the game. The world was a mess, so the devil meant what he said about total death and destruction. <laughs> Let us begin. 
Looks like it's doing fine as is, but he'll need me to get rid of that pesky wizard. Jump. Altar of Bones. Which begs the question, what kind of wizard can't the devil deal with himself? Hello, Mr. Owl. Hoo hoo hoo! Look who bothered to show up. I trust you haven't already lost your brain in that gourd. Grown men have died for less than that bird. Tardy and insubordinate. Not an amazing first impression, Jack. Who are you and how do you know my name? I am a servant of the devil and here to monitor your work. The devil hasn't forgotten your passion for trickery, Jack. He doesn't trust you. Don't slow me down. I haven't got how to roast a chicken. Hoo hoo hoo. Just remember who gave you that fancy new body. Speaking of which, let's begin your orientation. Orientation? What kind of fool do you take me for? The kind who spent centuries in Caporeus. Now stop dawdling. It's time you get acquainted with your new form. And so we begin the tutorial. Very nice aesthetic. I like the spookiness of it. It'd be wise to drink from these cauldrons. The primordial stew holds your body together. Sip. They're kind of like healing or safe spots, I'd say. Okay. Double jump. To boot. How your magical body is? Your body's magical. Okay. Double jump in. When do I get my scythe, though? That's what I want. Oh. oh. Let's swing around and get this, uh... In some cultures, crow skulls are good luck and ward off evil. Oh, are they? Indeed, indeed. New checkpoint. Oh, it's a checkpoint. That's what it is. Okay. And a save point. That's good. Get a running start and then double jump across the river. Is it a way to run or is it just build up speed by moving? Looks like you just build up speed by moving. All right. Mr. Owl, hello. Oh, not bad so far, Jack. You've shaken off those cobwebs well. It does feel good to have my own body again. Arms, legs, everything. You really put them to the test from here. We'll be monsters ahead. You shouldn't have any trouble fighting them off. Well, I've never been one to turn down a chance to bash some heads in. But why should they attack me? Has nobody told them I'm on their side? They can't be told anything, Jack. Mindless monsters are mostly mindless creatures. They can barely tell each other apart, let alone something like you. Pumpkin or not, you're still human. That alone makes you their target. So that's why the devil needs me. He needs someone who can think like a man. This new enemy is clever, Jack. He needs someone just as clever. I see. And he doesn't mind that I'm cutting down his monsters. <laughs> They're practically worthless. Do what you must. Just get the job done. You got it, Mr. Owl. Dodge attacks with E. Before I... Okay. Is there a delay on it? Nope, I can keep doing it. Nice. All right. The raven. Ah, it's back, it's back. Flap away, everyone. Flap for your lives. Ah, great, more birds. Let me through before I pluck you all raw. Stay away from us, Starcrow. I've, I've got claws and I can use them. Me, a common scarecrow. I'm Jack, the greatest rogue to ever live. Wait, he's got legs. The scarecrow doesn't have legs. And his head isn't stuffed with straw. See, I'm no square crow. Now let me through, you COVID creeps. Caw, not so fast. It seems the birds have the upper hand for once. Let you through, Mr. Jack, if you help us in return. At the mercy of a crow. What do you want? 
A scarecrow often appears in that barn just ahead. He's been terrorizing us for weeks. He's a menace to crow kind. And I suppose you want me to get rid of him? Yes, yes. And I'll help you too, Boot. My wings are swift and my beak is sharp. Huh. Some air support could be very useful. Very well, bird. Ka ka za! Death to the straw faced menace! Let's go. I'm ready, Jack. Let's crow. <laughs> Let's crow, he says. All right. So I kind of have like a uh, arranged thing that can help me do that stuff. All right. New checkpoint. So I got to look around for little uh, things I can bop like that with. All right, so we can take out like ranged enemies. That's nice. Seems like he has a cooldown, though. He has to uh, return before I can use him again. Grab a shovel. It's mostly rust, but I suppose a we any weapon's better than none. All right. All right, so I gotta click each time I want to attack. All right. It's not a hold down kind of thing. Let's see here. So I can't tell the crow to go anywhere without actually uh, having a target, huh? Or oh, does this stuff generate my health as well if I were to be losing some? Potentially, huh? Okay. Ooh, I see you back here, crow skull. Apparently there's 20 in this level. Oh boy. How many fanfics have I read on my channel? Oh, I do not know. Um, probably... Nah, I have no idea. I can't even, like, begin to quantify how many I've had. Uh, maybe 50 or so? Including all the, like, short, like, one-off ones that don't have, like, multiple chapters and stuff. For, like, just followed Equestria ones, I've probably read maybe, like... 10? Somewhere between 20 and 20, I'd say, for the Fallout Equestrias. Yeah. Alright. Ow! Okay. You know, fire burns things, right? Shut up, crow. Would you have left shift like slow you down? Hello, Mr. Mummy. Wait, wait, don't hurt me. Uh, you can talk. Yes, but I'm not here to hurt you, sir. Are you sure? You look like a monster to me. Rotten, half dead, soulless. Of course! I'm a salesman! Uh, well, now, I just want to kill you anyway. No, 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 stop! At least browse my wares first! What are you selling? Skins! I harvest the skins of interesting dead people for other people to wear. Clothes, too. Ah, uh, right. Well, I won't kill you, but I want a discount. By all means, please, take a look. Okay, so I can buy different outfits here from him. Okay, I, I gotcha. 40, 30, yada, yada, yada. All right, so I can afford one. What's this? The lumber. I like this one before, so. Stop shopping. Okay, they have candles on them, they'll turn into fire. Gotcha. Yeah, Fallout Equestria is... Uh, Fallout Equestria, Fallout... Ah, Project Horizons is a long story. Um, Falling Shadows 
I think they want to be longer than that, is what the authors are planning, so that's going to be a, a fun one. I'm not even sure how far along in the story we are. We might be like halfway. We might be a little more than halfway. Not sure. Can I destroy this corn? I can. You know, when he said there was a barn up ahead, I was thinking, oh, it was going to be like just down the road, but nah, he's like, let's go for like a, a journey. better at dodging. I'm not doing too well on that front. All right. <clears throat> at least the check won't restore your health. That's nice. I see you back there, Skull. Yoink. since there was a uh, stuff like that. All right. Mm -mm. Mm -hmm. Nailed it. All right. The hanging skeleton up there. Do you think it's alive? Its eyes are glowing after all. All right, let's explore around a little bit. Oh, there's one. Haha. -ha. How many have I read where Pinkie Pie is the villain? Um. Let's see. At least two? Um. I'm thinking about the ones that I've done where she's, like, just a character. Like, uh. Uh, the. Silent Ponyville ones, but those aren't technically. Uh, her being a villain. There was Long Winter? No, Merchants of Hope was Pinkie Pie being the evil one. Uh, there was, uh, of course, Cupcakes and stuff like that. Really, any horror ones with Pinkie Pie are quite lovely. Perhaps your new body isn't needed here. Hop out for a minute and look inside. Hop out of my body. Of course, your new body is just a shell. You can always... Use your head. <laughs> Wait a minute. You mean he can get out of thing? Earth, not disgusting. Cram it, bird. Hop to it, Jack. Drop your body and head inside. <laughs> so I have to use one of these, and then I can, like. Oof. Oh, man. That's. Interesting. I'm assuming I gotta pull the levers. Can I? Okay, yeah. Um, I think there is one medic. All right, I gotta hit that. Uh... Oh, I see what I gotta do. Okay. That's simple. <laughs> Let's do that. Get that bad boy. Gotta push this boy over here. Eh. Drop up here. Up here. And up here. Boop. Easy. Open sesame. All right. Before I go there, though, there was a lot of space over this way. 
More than likely, there's another skull over here somewhere. Maybe behind that rock where that glow is coming from. Hello there. Yep, I think that's all of them in this little area here. Yep, yeah, alright. Moving on. Actually, can I... Get on top of this? Nope. Alright. Cauldron. That's better. rats there we go ah, just go around it Boop. wait didn't the previous one say 30 maybe am I dumb I don't know I could be let's see First, let's grab this one back here. All right. And we'll just sneak on up here. So far, not a bad little game. Anything down there on that loft? Doesn't look like it. I think I got the, the skeletons down. They kind of do a little wind up before they actually attack. That way you can kind of dodge out of the way nice and easy. Got him. All right. I see a glow coming from up there. Let's jump back up here, shall we? I need to get over there. I think we can go through this way and get to it. Ah, potions. Yes. Oh, there's one back there. Hold on. Yeah, I think that, uh, now that I remember it, that the Pinkie Pie robot was definitely from the one where it, uh, uh, was in that barn, the party barn. this game is. Oh god, that's fire. Okay, this is bad. Especially if I'm getting stuck in the fire like that. Stay out of the fire. Uh, head time? Do you smell smoke? Mm, kinda. We gotta get the flap out of here, Jack. Crow, please. Run, Jack, the barn is collapsing. Who'd have thought dry straw would burn? I don't know, who would have thought? Who would have thought using candles to light a barn full of straw would cause so many issues? some white hot like tracks there Oop. I 
God damn. There's so much going on. That's a very bright hallway to be going down. Easy. Where was that scarecrow we were supposed to be killing, though? Wow, you wrecked the place, Jack. Didn't see that awful scarecrow. He must be back in the fields. We killed his home. Now we come for him. Let's go, Mr. Crow. We will destroy him. I don't see any schools out there. All right. So there's a recharge rate for that, huh? Yep. I see one back here, though. Ba -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba Yoink. All right. Ah. Our first boss battle shall be legendary. Hello, Mr. Scarecrow. Who goes there? Show yourself. Uh, there it is. Car. He just as menacing as always. Doesn't even have any legs. Don't be so craven. He's just a bog standard scarecrow. D did he see me? Please tell me he didn't see me. Yeah. <laughs> well, look who's here. Back for more, little birdie. Car. He saw me. Flee, flee, flee! Stop wetting yourself. As for you, it's time you hopped away. <laughs> I heard you're sulking around here, Jack. The dim-witted monster's not cutting it for the old man. Hmm. I have my own business, Scarecrow. If you don't get out of my way, I won't mind turning you into kindling. The devil has the gall to send some wayward souls to do our jobs for us. Well, we'll show him all you humans are good for, living or dead. I'll burn you again, you wretch. Alright, let's use the crow to knock him down. Get him a couple of hits. Jump over that. Don't double jump though, because that's don't give me no time to bring the rush one. Okay, okay, I got you. Mess up the scary boys. Got him. Alright, and then repeat. It's really like forgiving about you messing up that part, it seems. I'm just gonna dodge all the way of all those. Alright, third time's the charm, let's go! <laughs> oh, he disappeared. Hey, it was the rule of threes. <gasps> A new weapon! Dun 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 dun! Oh, that's beautiful. Pumpkin Jack. Stingy Jack, the genius trickster who could fool even the devil himself, has returned to the mortal realm. Armed with a brand new body and his soul cruelly bound to a festering pumpkin, Jack has been joined by his stoic guides, the owl, and commandeered the services of a cowardly crow to fight on his behalf. But there must be no more time for Jack and his companions of the night must embark upon their quest to slay the wizard. With Jack now perfectly attuned to his new vessel, the owl leads him to the mountains in the distance. For at the heart of the mountains, through a network of ancient mines, lies a powerful secret. Is the powerful secret the friends made along the way? <clears throat> Alright, can't go back that way. You got to check behind you all the time. Because you never know when the developers might be like, hey, let's hide something right behind them. Who would think to look behind them? Tab to open inventory. Oh, I can switch between the shovel and the... Whatever this is. The hook. Is there a reason to, though? Does the shovel give me, like, a special ability? 
We might find that out later. Does it attack differently? Okay, it does. Interesting. Owl. Woohoo! Here we are, and not a second behind schedule. What is this place? These old mines are brimming with power. It's on the devil's belief that deep in these tunnels lies the key to our enemy's plot. So we're here to take it first and get the drop on whoever's looking for it, too? Gah, this, this place gives me the willies. Remind me again while I'm still here. Because you're useful to me, and I'll pummel you if you even try to flap off. Ooh, ooh. This is a good old mine equipment. It's a bit rusted to bits, but these tunnels are solid. Hop to it, Jack. Oof, I don't like that. I'm foreseeing a mechanic. I feel like we're gonna go for a cart ride. I'm gonna have to use the crow to make uh, switches in the, uh, the rails to uh, navigate a ways. Did that come back for me? Okay, that's a little scary. Yes, we're gonna like, at some point during this map, we're gonna be definitely in a cart and uh, we're definitely going to be having to use the crow to switch like a, a switch mechanism to go like left or right on a track. That's how it's gonna be, I know it. <laughs> God, my voice is still kinda messed up from recording earlier. New enemy, huh? Oh god. It just like pukes at you. That's messed up. Okay. Just wanted to make sure there wasn't a, a hidden skull there or anything. <clears throat> oh, 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 oh. Oh, okay. Woo! Almost fucked it up there. That could have been really bad. My fingers were uh, not wanting to work right there. They were being very uh, naughty. It gave me a... Uh, didn't it give me, like, when I was back this way, it gave me, like, a target on that tree? No? Do I see things? Okay, I have not found a skull yet, and it's kind of concerning me. There's one, though. I really like the spear. The, uh, the lunge attack is really nice to, like, gain ground on people. This was not the skull I was thinking about. I was thinking about the one up there, but, you know. Getting close. Fuck it up. There we go. That's going to be fun. Am I going to have the crow, like, touch those and destroy them? Ah, right, Mr. Owl, what you got? I hope you're ready for some cardio, Jack. You'll have to blow these rocks away with this. This seems, uh, sketchy. Oh. <laughs> Nani. Okay, the fact that those all have lit fuses is really concerning. Okay. Let's just restart. Alright, so it'll tell me where it goes when I hit it. Which is nice. I want to just hit the lever, please. There we go. It's like golf. Who'd have thought there'd be a golfing minigame here, huh? 
<clears throat> Fuck. Well. I was thinking since I was just on the side, I think I have to wait for the actual arrow to, like, move before I just kick it or else it'll mess up. Alright. So we're gonna be a little bit slower on that one, that's fine. So we're gonna be slow, then accidentally fuck it up and have it run into a, uh, water. Fuck. Fuck, 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 fuck. Let's go. Boop. Okay. Ha. Huh. Almost messed up there. Just line it up nice and easy. And kick it home. Bakum. And then I'm guessing rocks cave in. And there it goes. Get him, Crow. Got him. I missed what the Crow said there. Hmm. So if I uh, use the spear's, like, uh, forward momentum, I can bypass taking damage from the, uh, the spit. Or whatever the hell it is, I guess. Come on, you goddamn rats! Alright. Oh no. This is the part. No, 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 Jack. I know what you're thinking. I could use this minecart to get out of here faster. Or, if this emo canary doesn't cram a worm in it, I'll use him for pillow stuffing. If you go anywhere in that old cart, you'll kill us all. You can fly. I fail to recall when you were calling the shots. It'll take more than this rusted old sardine can to do me in. This Maleficent you're going in to report. What? Is going in your report. Okay. I totally misread that. Jack, you madman. Let's go. <laughs> So I can go left and right. Do I have to jump too? Yep. I knew it. Yep. There's me hitting, using the bird. Although I don't necessarily need to use him to switch the cart tracks, I guess. It was more to uh, have him remove barriers. Okay, motherfuckers. I almost missed that one, by the way. <laughs> I wasn't looking. Can I just like spam the right click button and then we'll just do it? Yeah, I could. It's hilarious. Not nearly as dramatic though as when I do like that. Like wait, and then. So I gotta use the uh, left and right arrows to kind of stay on the track and not fall over. Oh god, I almost fucked that up. Oh, I forgot to jump almost. Oh my god, that was spooky. Can't see. Okay. Oh boy, that was harrowing. I see you up there, Skull. Can I climb up there? I can hit those <laughs> thing there, though. That's nice. Is that a skeleton with a crossbow? It is. Okay, get out of the ass and stuff, please. Oh, yeah. Group up. That's perfect. <laughs> Let me just sneak around here and grab that real quick. Okay. Uh, I'm trying to see if there's a way for me to get up 
to that skull. I'm assuming maybe if I go around further, I can, but... I'm just not sure. I don't want to miss it, you know? Jesus. Okay, I think I just loop around here. I want to go around there when I can just go over the roof. Damn it. Nah. Right. I was wondering if I could just, like, uh, spam the, the roll and the melee and just uh, be, like, invincible. But it does not give you a chance to attack between rolls. If you just kind of mash them like that. Ow. Just that one. Hi, oh, cool. That's how we get up there. So. Anything else down there before I head up further? Doesn't look like it. Oof. Hold your horses, Jack. I was actually going to run across these and like, do it in one try, but uh, they slowed me down on purpose. Uh, so unfortunately, I could not do that. Mm. It was going to be really amazing and badass, but they, they slowed me down. Grab that boy. Oop. Oop. There we go. Okay, I just gotta go this way. I wonder if maybe there was a skull or something around that side, but I don't see anything. Oop. Made it. Hell yeah. That's better. Nice. All right. Nope, oh, hold up. This is fishy. Is that a... One of the old tiny uh, audio things? I forget what they're called. Oh my god. Oh my god, this is great. It's grooving a little. Yeah. Mm. Go, Jack, go! as bones fall from the sky around him. What was the purpose of that, though? Gramophone used, or discovered. But what does that do, exactly? Jack got the moves. Oh, so Tab just slows down time. Like, to a crawl. I can still move and stuff, though, so... Whenever trying to, like, dodge something in a split of a second, just oh, hit that, and then... Yeah. All right. Oh, hello there, Mr. Uh, thing. Oh, you must go no further. This place does not welcome you. Who dares turn me away? I'm Jack, mercenary of the devil himself. I am the guardian of this place and the powers it contains. Heed this warning, Jack. If you do not leave willingly, you will be removed from here in a thousand pieces. Cool story, bro. Oh, this is gonna suck. All right, let's go. Who is lighting all of these uh, carts on fire, by the way? Or all this TNT on, like, fire and stuff? 
It's uh, very weird that it all just happens to be uh, lit, right? Also, why do I have a shovel out? There we go. Wait for the next group, and let's go. Oof. Let's look around here real quick. Okay. We're gonna have to start jumping over these things, huh? Take a moment to compose and go. And jump, jump, made it. All right. Out of the way, crows. Hold up. That's right, I see you down here. That didn't happen. You can't prove to me it did. Did I mention don't touch the carts? I don't did you? Okay, thank god I can climb from that. There we go. Take that one off. And let's go now. Alright, perfect. What's this then? Go for a drive. Uh, before we do that, let me take a moment. Look around. Any skulls here? Doesn't look like it. All right. It's drive time, baby. <laughs> Yoink. This music reminds me of, uh, like, Banjo-Kazooie type stuff. Also, totally would hit my head on these, like, uh, support beams when jumping, by the way. 100%. How does it keep getting momentum to go up? Almost missed that uh, jump there. All right, and we are out. Hell yeah. Hello, skin trader. How are you doing? What do you got today? Oh, it's you again. Come to browse more of my fabulous skins? Stop calling them that. Why? They're literally people's skins. I know. It's creepy. Well, if digging up corpses and er, intricately peeling off their skin to sell them as costumes is creepy... Then I guess I'm creepy. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Just buy something or go away. Hmm. The samurai. The cowboy. The inspector. Interesting. The buzzard. The buzzard could be cool. Maybe I'll save up for that one next. I still like Jack's original outfit compared to the other ones, though. <coughs> Excuse me. I guess it also reminds me that the the, the rail song. It reminds me of the uh, Chocobo uh, song. 
song when you're writing a chocobo in Final Fantasy? In a, in a way? Ever so slightly. Boop. Ow. Okay. It takes a bit before it becomes actually, like, deadly to you, it seems. Heed this second warning, Jack, for there will be no third. Turn back while you still can. I have nothing to fear from you, ghost. For your sake, Jack, I hope that's true. Very generous about the uh, the health it gives you back. Like I just got like murdered there a little, and then it was like, oh, back to full after killing a couple guys. So, hold your horses, Jack. Crow, listen, I could sprint across this and not fall. Okay. For the record, the ghost bozo really creeps me out. Yeah. Just a ghost, my man. Just a ghost. So, <laughs> all right. I wasn't sure if that was the right way or the other one was. Look, okay, that was the right way here. I'll just jump off there. Hey, stop firing at me! All right. Oh, another one of these. Ooh, spooky. I like how he just, like, snaps his neck around and gets uh, his head off. It's, it's very nice. Okay. Hoop, hoop. Interesting. Right, so this one isn't timed. It's just a, uh, a lever switch, huh? I use this and does that turn it? It does, okay. I understand, okay. Oop, don't hit that. That would have sucked. Can't see the line, but I have faith. Okay. So, can I get up? Here? Nope. I'm gonna have to go around, huh? Nope. Oh. Ooh, almost fucked up there. I was close. Come on, little pumpkin head, let's go. Alright, so we just punt it across here. And one more for good measure. Hit that lever. Ah, oh, man. Too far. Okay, let's do that. Ooh, that was close. Do that, and then pop! Easy. Hell yeah. Alright. Gotta watch out, make sure they don't decide to put hidden skulls there after you've already cleared the area, you know? Yeah, Ghost Archer, yeah? I'm gonna kill the archers first, and then we'll go with the rest of the stuff. Hey, get back here. Now, let's get the spawner. And the other spawner. Easy, alright. Oh no! Ah, crap, couldn't turn. Alright, let's try that again. Jump, jump, nope, 
For momentum. No. Okay. I got this. Hold up. Jump. Jump. Ooh. I suck. All right. Let's try this again. Jump. Jump. I'll just jump from there. That's easier. Rather than trying to jump and change momentum. Okay. Yoink. Hey, well, I got two more skulls left to go. Boom, baby. All right. Oh, boy. All aboard the midnight train. Going anywhere. End of the line, Jack. Oh boy. I may have jumped that other one a little bit too early. Every little um, uptick in this music, it seems to be when you time your jump. Have you noticed that? Like the do do do, -do the uh, the uptick in the do 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 do, it was uh, when I would have to jump, which was kind of interesting. Go no further. This is the end for you. You have passed the point of no return. Twice have I warned you, Jack. And yet I'm still here. If you want me gone, you'd better be prepared to throw me out. Come get me, Jack. Uh, we're really just gonna go in this vortex that was opened by this giant ghost specter? I guess we are. my opportunity to hit him here. Not there. The weapons are nothing against me, huh? Oh, I got it. Got him. Alright. That's how we do it. And then he removes some planks, makes it harder for us to uh, avoid him. Alright, here we go. Can't see, can't see, oh god. Oh boy. Got him. Oop. Oops. I wonder if I could just kind of like sit there and do nothing. The answer was no. Oh, 
Alright, throw your bombs out, buddy. Yeah, Got him. No, Jack, what have you done? Kicked your ass is what I fucking did. Yeah! <clears throat> Hello, Mr. Owl. Ooh, ooh, a commendable display, Jack. That body of yours surely proving useful. I've been toppling brutes his size since I was a lad. Really? What on earth do they feed kids where you grew up? Yes, yes, well done. Now for a flap. Now get a flap on. We're here for a reason. If I'm not mistaken, this mountain was once home to a tribe of powerful sorcerers. They must have left this tablet behind as their last testament. And this is it. Came all this way for a big rock with some words on it. Is that a tablet or an obelisk? Hmm. The darkest hours of man, champion, shall be summoned. Could you pick up the pace? Did you leave your glasses back in the nest or something? Ah, yes, yes, I see now. The Amulet of Final Ember. Ooh. Just saying, it makes me feel powerful. The last line is unreadable, but man's champion needs the amulet to muster the power to dispel the devil's curse. Rocks and jewelry. This is turning out to be pretty lame. Uh, so I might be missing something, but where's this amulet supposed to be? Why, it's down here. Um, hmm. What is it, bird? Where's the blasted thing? It's already gone, and rightly so. What the call is that? Talking birds and now talking swords. Yep, this is definitely a lame job. I must say, this is very peculiar. There. Stardust, thanks for the follow, my dude. In case you hadn't noticed, this place is lousy for magical stuff. No wonder people have been tripping over themselves swipe to swipe that amulet. And you! You've got a lot to answer for, you charlatan. Who? Well, I never. How dare you, you, you oversized butter knife? If you call that mess of a fight, I saw commendable. I thoroughly question your tutelage. You gordon face. Who are you? I'm Jack, and I like you already. Well, get used to me. If you are going to learn to fight, you need to learn how to fight right. Yada yada. I'll teach you. Wait, did you two miss the part where this thing said we were too late? Someone took the amulet? Who? 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 Take it easy. No need to yell the leather off your handle. I'll tell uh, your friend came and took the amulet. I assume you distracted that awful phantom so we could get here ahead of you. Our friend. Greetings! Ka? Yes, that chap. I'm guessing you don't know each other? Oh, I know more than enough. So you are the pariah, the champion of that devil himself who sent, sent him for me. Frankly, I am disappointed. Show yourself, you coward. I don't think so. I'm already long gone. I only stuck around to study your fight with my associate in the mines. Very enlightening. You really do put on a show. I'll be more than happy to give you an encore when I rip that face off your skull. And I'll pry that amulet from your cold, dead hands. We'll see about that. For now, this bobble requires further study to access its power. Perhaps you should join me. We can study it together to break this piffling little curse. This, this guy really gives me the creeps. He left an innocent spirit to be completely destroyed. Just to watch you fight? I may be evil, and I may work for the devil, but you, sir, are a jerk. Consider my proposal. There's so much more I want to study about you, Jack. 
And that's it. This just got personal. How dare he call me by my name. Ooh, I got magic sword now? <coughs> Great Jack, master of trickery, finally has had the tables turned on him. Upon reaching the tablet of the heart of the mountain, Jack bitterly discovers that he is too late. The clever, cold-hearted wizard, humanity's champion, now possesses a powerful ember and is one step closer to usurping the devil's rule over the world and breaking the curse. But there is still hope for our heroine heroes. Jack's epic duel with the wizard's indentured spirit catches the attention of a magical sword who vows to teach him greater mastery of the deadly arts. Determined to close the gap between himself and the enemy, Jack and his companions rush from the mountain and follow the wizard's trail of magic into the wilderness. All right, all right, all right. So when we have the magic sword out, we float. That's, uh, interesting. Show me what you've learned, Jack. Okay. I hope you're ready to crash course and killing, Jack. I'm glad he floats now. It's a lot spookier. Uh, this way. Hello, Owl. <clears throat> Whew. Well, this is a fine turn of events. Owls in swamps don't mix. Neither do I. You have ten seconds to explain why I'm here. Whoa, Jack, have you no faith in your trusty, reliable companion? Eight, seven, six. Jack, I am your superior. You will treat me with res- Four, three, two. All right, all right. Dear Lucifer, you're a rambunctious little twerp. I've been following the magical energy of the portal the wizard cast. And that magic has led us on a trail straight through this swamp, and it ends here. Perhaps there's some clue to his destination further in. There, was that so hard? Oh, shut up. All right. Almost got me there. Oh boy. Whatever happened here, it was bad. Yeah. A little. Alright, cannot dodge in the air. Good to know. Also, this rock looks a little bit like a sarcophagus. Just the, the top of it. If you eliminate the bottom there, kind of like a tomb, right? Or a, not a tomb, a coffin. Huh. I'm gonna go this way. Oh my gosh, the skin seller. Really? Skin seller, I need your strongest skin, please. Look, it's my new favorite customer. What are you talking about? I can't stand you. And I don't have any other customers. See our problem here? You're lucky your work is so good. My mother used to say that in my family sweatshop, all right. So, yep, we're gonna still save up. <clears throat> Ugh. All right, moving on. Boop. Boop, boop. Boop, boop.
I think I like the spear better, if I'm being honest. been a while since I've seen a, uh, a cauldron, right? Oh, gods! We're cool. We're good. Everything's okay. Uh, tree. There we go. Alright. Mm. Take two on that. That box messed me up. Yeah, baby. All right. Oh, no, I'm gonna miss it. Fuck! <laughs> I should have waited. That was my bad. I got too, like, oh, I just want to go. I want to go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. And uh, that fucked me up a little bit, I'd say. Let's wait for the next one. And not be overzealous to just jump off. Here we go. Wait for it. And go. Oh, okay. That was not fair. I literally just walked across the bridge. <laughs> it was like, nah, there's a gap there, fool. Ah, okay. I'm really getting this part down, though. Get the fuck out of my face, you goddamn barrel. Is that a skull all the way over there? Do you see that? Surely that can't be, right? I don't think it's right. Nope. I don't think that's a skull. I think it's just a light. Okay. I'm getting my ass kicked here. What the hell's going on? Oh boy. That wasn't great. some stuff here. Anything else I can smash to get some health? Nope. Okay. Let me smash that stuff. There we go. Alright, perfect. Uh, sorry, this is really sketchy, right? It's like a First skeletons and have ghosts, now wood has ghosts. What's next? A pebble? Yeah, that, that really messed with my mind. Oh my god. Hello there, sir. You seem to have some coffins on your back. Well, 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 a new face. Always a pleasant surprise to meet some new friends around here. Who are you supposed to be? Why, I am a local merchant. My name is... 
I haven't asked for your name, and I don't plan on caring. Um, all right. Well then, who are you? My name's Jack. I'm tracking a loathsome little wizard into his swamp. Did you say Jack? As in THE Jack? And that depends upon which Jack you mean. The Jack who tricked the devil himself. Not once, not twice, but three times? Huh. Most people leave out the third time. Yes, old timer, I'm THE Jack. Oh, joyous day. Hurrah! She'll be so happy. What are you talking about, you old coot? Oh, n nothing really. I just have something to attend to around here. Please, find me along the way again. I believe I can help you. Very well, anything for a fan. Yeah, would you want to talk, though? Same dialogue, okay. Okay. Seems we've got a, uh... Another shop at some point that we'll be able to interact with. Almost, uh, glanced right back into that. Am I the only one who doesn't trust that guy? I don't know. He seems quite trustworthy. He's just a guy with some coffins on his back. What's not to trust? Ooh. Okay. Battles are getting a little bit more lively now. Maybe I should just dodge until all their uh, uh, range stuff is done. Skeleton ghosts. They fell, uh, fall to pieces easily, yada yada. Don't swerve into me, you bastard. So where do I jump from here? Back over to here, I guess? Okay. No, you piece of shit! Okay, so let's, let's not attack those guys like that again. I wasn't expecting my, uh, my spear to just take me and, uh, fuck off into the wilderness like that. That was, uh, very rude of it. Let's get to some more stable, uh, footing before we do anything here, huh? Not, not again. Nope. Yep. Fuck you guys. <laughs> we'll just ignore them. I don't care, then. Oh, mystical cauldron. Take my save point so I can not resurrect back further there, because that sucks. All right. Oop. Hit, hit, hit. Nope, hit, hit. Okay, seriously? There we go. Ah, oh, yes. Sneaking across... Sneaking across ghost beams. Fun, fun. I wonder how high they have their little, uh... Things. I wonder how... If they switch up their, uh... Their kill counts, or death counts, I guess. With different things, like if they have them like, up to like 100, or if they just have like a bunch that kind of recycle. Yeah, eat it. Not so deadly now, are you, that I'm dodging every five seconds. 
Honestly, I'll be honest with you. The spear is not so good when it comes to fighting things that are next to a ledge. Let's just throw that out there. Alright, I'm just gonna come through you guys. I already got the the skull there, it seemed, so I can just kind of bypass that. And dodge, 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 go, go, go. Get to the cauldron. Okay. Well, that was unfortunate. Mm. Ah, yes. Hello, sir. Ooh, is this a horse? Hey, buddy. Ah, Jack, there you are. I'm so glad we meet again. I wanted to tell you about my wife. I don't care much about you. Why would I care about your wife? She's idolized you for centuries. She's your biggest fan. Do go on. We've been married for 343 years, but she's always adored your tales. We've spent many nights discussing your feats of malice and trickery. She's a powerful witch, and I'm out here collecting ingredients for her greatest concoction. A witch, huh? I could use her. This words is powerful and smart. I need her information. I'm sure she'd love to help, but I need to gather her ingredients first. If you can help me find the mushrooms she needs, I'll take you to her. Why must I pick up your errands? Why can't you just tell me where she is? Only my horse can take you to her. Find the mushrooms and you can ride him. Stupid plot contrivances. Fine, I'll fetch your stupid mushrooms. Much obliged. I'll stay right here and um, wait your return. Of course. All right. Glowing mushrooms. Oh boy. That mushroom looks very poisonous. Mushrooms are best. I never got into him as a chick and never gave him up. Oh. Right. Well, that was certainly a uh, thing, I suppose. Okay. All right. So let me bounce higher. Boop. 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 And boop. I thought I was gonna ground pound there. Apparently not. Oh god! Oh, okay, they're timed. Gotcha. Craptastic. And I'm dead. I, I misjudged that jump, I think. That's kind of what got me. Alright. Which way do I fucking go? I'm so lost now. I think I gotta go this way. Did I come from... I came from here. Damn it. Okay. Yep, I remember smashing through these. Okay. At least I already got the, uh... Stuff. Oh, fuck you, you son of a bitch! That was close. Okay. Pumpkin head. Let's go, go, go.
Okay, so let's see. Green, red, pink, pink, red. Is that what I'm doing? It can't be. I don't know how the fuck I remembered that. That third one looks like a face. The logs, anyway. Third log looks like a face. So, <clears throat> I didn't memorize them by color. I memorized it by saying one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then uh, I just kind of went from there. I don't know how the fuck I memorized that. But let's go. Perfect, Jack. Now bring it to me. I don't know, man. You can open up portals. That's a little sketchy. Here's your mushroom. Ah, this is superb. I haven't seen a mushroom grow this well in decades. Thank you, Jack. Truly, your legend doesn't live up to your glory. Yeah, yeah. I know I'm amazing now, make with the horse. Certainly, he knows the way. Well, just hop on and ride. This is sketchy. Let's do this. Uh oh, is this like a minecart scene? Do -do 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 -do. It is. Oh god. Here we go. Oh god, he has jumps. Okay. I was not expecting that. Around these. hard to tell there when I needed to jump and when I was okay to not jump. Left to right. I'm going right. Although the wiser choice would have been left since there was actually a path further up ahead. Anyway. Cauldron. This way. Open sesame. Yep, there's a crow skull on top of here.
Oh, your horse is Jack. The design of this level is nice and spooky. I like it. I guess I'll jump, right? Yeah, I just don't get any form of momentum from it, though, unfortunately. Yeah, I'm here. Sorry about breaking some shit. What up? Oop. Jack! There you are, my friend. Take it easy, fanboy. What do you want now? Well, you remember that mushroom you found for me? It's perfect, don't get me wrong. It's just... Not enough? You motherfucker. Ten, nine, eight... No, 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 wait a second, oh great Jack. I just need one more mushroom, then I'll show you straight to my wife. You can even use my horse again. Well, what do you say, Jack? Can you help out a fool who's just trying to be the husband the love of his life deserves? Fine, this is the last time. Don't think I won't cut you apart. Yeah, okay. I'm just gonna go this way anyway. Um... What's this gonna open up? It does that. Okay. Is it time then? I see. Oof, okay. Get along, little doggy. Hold on, there's uh mushrooms over here. We're gonna get some more dancing jack boys. Woohoo! Alright, let's do this. Shorter last time, but that's okay. I don't know what those do though. as killing rats is I need to stop them from spawning in order to progress all right huh oh my god well let's wait till they all disappear out so I can go faster. All right. Tap. Tap. Almost had me. Always look behind you. You never know what you'll find. Sipping on that good shit, hell yeah. Alright. It is time for the school! Uh, the school. The pumpkin, I guess. Okay. I won't be able to do it this time, so let's, uh. Let's see. Okay, got it. Red, green, red, green, red, green, blue, gray, pink. Fuck. Okay. So. Do, 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 
do 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 What an acid trip that heart is, huh? Hoorah! Mine. This one's perfect. Good job, Jack. Now bring it back to me. Me, 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 me. Are you going to be the second level boss, my dude? Aha! Another marvelous mycelium. Brilliant, Jack. All right. Are we done with this shopping list of yours now? Yes, certainly. The horse is yours. Take him as far as you'll go and keep going after. I guess you don't get a lot of company over if that's how you give people directions. Let's ride. I think I could have just walked around that one. I'm tempted to try it. See what'll let me. Not that one Yeah, don't have to actually shoot it. Okay. That's nice. I don't know why I'm holding W when I don't really need to. Because the horse just goes by itself and I can't speed it up. So. Force of habit, I suppose. Platforms really sketch me out, I'm gonna be honest. They really sketch me out. I always forget how far he lunges when uh, he does that. Short time. Okay, so actually jumping on these hurts. Good good to know. I don't know why I did it again just to prove the point, but ouch. I know why I did it again to prove the point, because I'm an idiot, that's why. That's exactly why I did it. Um, I gotta go back. go. I just need three more and I'll have all the skulls in this level. <laughs> you 
can't tell, but I'm rather upset. Maybe you can tell. Because I fucked it up again. Oh my god. He was climbing up! My man! Oh, bro. Okay, they're starting to repeat. The, uh, the death counts. Because that one was, uh, you can't break omelets without breaking ten eggs. Which we had at two deaths. So, they do, uh, go. I guess they only had, like, nine programmed, maybe? <clears throat> okay, we made it further down. That's the jump attack. Oh my god, if I would have fucking known that. That's beautiful. I like it. Hello. <sighs> you must be Jack. How do you know my name? You under overrated gondolier. Word travels fast around here. I've been paid in advance to take you to the witch, but I still accept tips. First flying horses and now penny grubbing ferrymen. What's next? Complain all you want, but I'm here on the way to get where you're headed. All right, fine. I can use the rest. A nice calm boat ride sounds fine to me. Who said anything? About calm. Bruh. Well. Let's see how this goes. Enjoying the ride? Good. Because here comes the fun part. Time to jump ship, motherfucker. I wasn't ready! You piece of shit. You could have just not done that, man. Oh god, there's a lot of those guys. Holy crap. At least these guys just die in one hit. That's nice. We jump in ship again? Huh? Really? Why? What is the point of this, gondolier man? Why is it upside down now? My boy, what are you doing? Well, yeah, that one's probably taking on water because of your fucking sick flips, man. What are you doing? skulls. Watch him flip the boat while I'm fighting. I think that motherfucker. Ow, dude! Calm down! soon enough. You bastard. Let's do that and grab those things. Okay. <clears throat> Easy so far. Could you imagine if I was using the spear, how fucked up this would be? Hmm. Oh, thank god, looks like we're done. Here we are! And don't think I didn't notice you skip the tip. I thought you were evil, not a jerk. Yeah, well, you kind of flipped the ship a couple of times, so... All this for some witch. Her information better be worth this. 
<clears throat> hmm. What is it now, bird? If this forest, I can't describe it, but it's strange. I can sense a witch's magic. She's not too far from here. But watch your step, Jack. Something tells me this forest is dangerous if you don't know the way. If you're not careful, one wrong step could be the end of you. So, you can tell all that, but you can't tell me how to get through safely. Call it a plot contrivance. Don't dwell on it, just get going. I wish I could help you, but this time you're on your own. You motherfucker. Huh. It's like, uh... The Lost Forest. I'm assuming since he mentioned crows, if we go the crow way, we... Okay, so don't go the way of the crows. Gotcha. Of course. So if there's crows, don't go that way. Okay. Easy enough. Crows, crows, no crows. Crows, crows. Ah, uh, hold on. I just can't go that way, but I can go this way and then take a left. I can go this way and take a right. I can go straight here. I can go right over here. God, imagine putting a fucking raven skull in here somewhere that I'd have to like find. Oof. Okay, there's ravens that way. Crows that way. Crow skull, raven skull. All right. Hmm. Crows, crows. Imagine not getting the uh, the crow thing right away, and then like just getting lucky in the paths you choose, or not realizing the crows, and you just keep dying. I'd be so upset if I didn't realize the crows were there. All right. <clears throat> not much further, Jack. She can hardly wait to meet you. She's gonna be the boss, isn't she, dude? I already have a feeling about that. Hold on. So, yep, crow's there. Skull. Thank you. Two more. So we're going this way. Okay. Looks like we're going up this way. Just wanted to make sure there weren't any skulls. Okay. At least the skulls are fairly obvious here, huh? Is this the witch? Aren't you a little short to be a witch? Ha ha ha! Jack, Jack, the great Jack is back! I'm such a big fan. Ooh, look at me, I'm starstruck. Finally, someone who appreciates my hard-forged legacy. I've been told you might have some information about finding someone I need. <laughs> you mean the wizard of the human champion? Of course, one travels fast, you know. So I've been told. What can you tell me? Hmm, perhaps you'd like to know his name? His name? Yeah, tell me. <laughs> ah, yes, Jack. Anything for a legend like you. Now listen closely. The wizard's name is... Odd, loud noise out of nowhere. Yoink. 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 What kind of name is Yoink? No, no, no. You're not saying it right. It's more like... Yoink. and they just yoinked my head. You son of a bitch. Yoink! Ah, what the hell are you doing? I'm so sorry to trick you, Jack, but after all, it's one of yours. My own ploy is used against me. Well played, you harpy. D don't forget my part in all this, Jack. Shush, hun. You're sounding really desperate. Put me back right now. 
I'm afraid I can't do that, Jack. I'm cooking up a magic, something magical, and you're just what I need to put it all together. We should go, dear, before we miss our time. Right away, away. This is horrible. How the heck are we going to now? We're going to get Jack back before they hollow out his noggin. Even more. But how? You know how Jack can hop in and out of his body? Y yes Well, hop in. I think I need to throw up first. We better head off now. <laughs> Cha -cha. This pumpkin is perfect and it's last ingredient I need. <clears throat> Get in the goddamn body, crow. Also convenient horse. I knew it. The high hope will receive. How did they get this? Surely they, like... Surely this is copyright, right? I can't tell if I'm supposed to, like, do something here, or... Like, just avoid them, like, directly into them. Because they seem to be, like, in specific areas that I can't, like, dodge. I don't know. I guess kind of get you just get to one side. Ah, God damn it. I'm just kind of all over the place here. Fuck! I had like no time to dodge that. The bitch! Yeah, I had no time to dodge that. <sighs> okay. From the beginning, or. Yep. Well, now I'm not gonna be an idiot and. I'm not gonna be an idiot and walk straight into that fucking wall. That's what I'm fucking not about to do. Whoa, 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 whoa. God damn it. God damn me. That was rigged. Y'all saw that was rigged, right? That was a dick move. I can't even get past the beginning now. Holy shit. Maybe I can just jump over him? Is that what I can do? Yeah, I can. Okay. Also, I just fucked myself up on the fucking sides there. Mm. Okay, I got it. If I can, I can just jump over them if I need to. Oh, get in there, fucking son of a bitch! Nope, nope. Not today. Come on, please let this fucking thing end. I don't have enough health for this man. Killing me here! Quite literally. Okay. Ooh. Ah, 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 ah. Finally, we have some guests to come visit. And all it took was a small kidnapping. Give back that pumpkin now! Whatever wicked spell you're working on, we will stop it. A spell? A spell? M well, a spell, you know, the, the mushrooms, the collagen, the possessed pumpkins. Oh, you stupid bird, this isn't a spell. It's our dinner! Your dinner? Of course, we're vegans. Oh, no. The worst kind of people. <laughs> uh, this is magic mushroom stew. Okay, but why eat me? This is hardly cruelty-free. Well, no, but pumpkins are real superfood, especially possessed ones. Do you know how hard it was to get souls in a vegan diet? You don't count. Ah, uh, you're both insane. Let me be a coward, Jack. Uh, but I'm taking Jack back. You don't want to stay for dinner? <laughs> well, then you'll be a fine centerpiece for our spread. Don't scuff up my body, bird. I just got that thing. Eep. Okay, I'm assuming I'm taking out these eyes, right? Guess I want to avoid those. So can I just, like... Okay. I can't damage the eyes, apparently. 
Hold on. Okay, I got it. There we go. Okay, don't hit the those ones though. All the ones are okay. Alright, I cannot hit the higher ones yet. Got it. Ignore that fire one for a second. Let's go over here. go. Nailed it. Oops. Ah, fuck that up. Okay. I hold the Dario. All right. Was that? Is that a? It looked kind of like a carriage when I'm doing that, almost right. In a weird way. Oops, that one was a little bit too off to the side. There we go. Got two for one. Ouch. mechanic. I like it. Also, I don't know why last time I was going in the opposite direction as the fucking thorns. Can you imagine being that much of an idiot? Actually, this is perfect. Yeah, just go around in a circle so I can just, like, not move and just punt them back to you whenever I see them. Beautiful. Ow. Got it. Okay. Ow, okay, Jack, first of all. Made it. Hooah! Got him. Peace out, or not. Yo. I got you, Jack. Hey, look over there. Guess what witch picked up spare magic wand. Wait, is that a gun? Oh, yes. A magic wand. In their hubris to hunt down the witch. Jack and his avian accomplices followed the only trail available that they could find in the woods. At the behest of a fawning merchant, Jack was sent on a wild goose chase in the hopes of meeting a powerful witch. Traversing the merciless landscape on horseback, and with the help of an ignoble barrier, Jack's efforts soon paid off, and he met with the witch, only to have his own head stolen for their supper. With the assistance of the cowardly crow, Jack was reunited with his body. And now, with the wizard's trail gone cold, Jack and his companions have only instinct and gumption to guide them. They hurry to follow the sounds of cannon and gunfire to find the city at war. Indeed. I like how they gave me a gun and we're going to a war zone. Oh my god! Oh my god! What's the jump attack? Wait, can I just like fire multiple in the sky or not? Nope, just one at a time. I like it. That's beautiful. Okay. Anyway, folks, I think this is where we end things for right now. It's been a couple hours. I'm enjoying the game. Um, if you guys want to see more of it, we might do some more. Uh, not tomorrow, but next week we could do some more. 
That kind of depends upon if we want to do iron harvest or this. We could do maybe iron harvest on one day and then this one on the other day until we finish it. I'm not sure how long this game is. Um, tomorrow, we're doing Watch Dogs Legion, though. Um, it should release tomorrow, and then I'll have to download it, so this stream could be a little later than usual. It kind of depends upon how long it takes to download. Um, but yeah, so that's the plan for that. Uh, I know Cyberpunk got pushed back. So we won't be playing that on the 11th when it releases, because it'll be releasing uh, in December. But that's all right. Uh, hey, thanks for the follow, Medic. Um, but yeah, Watch Dogs got... Or not Watch Dogs. Blah. Cyberpunk got pushed back, but I think that's fine. There's a lot of stuff that comes out in November anyway. And uh, I'd rather they have a, a good product that they want to release rather than a rush product that people just want to play. So Anyway, thank you all for hanging out, stopping by and all that. Um, tomorrow, we'll start the stream up at about the same time. Um, like I said, depends upon if I get the, the download started properly here or not. But uh, tomorrow we'll be doing Watch Dogs Legion, at least the beginning of it. Uh, I don't plan on making Watch Dogs Legion a playthrough, just uh, a short little, here's the game kind of thing. So, until next time, everyone, I will catch you all later. Bye for now.